it's Anna here. So for today's video, it's actually going to be a small business sort of vlog sort of situation. Some of you guys have been requesting this, so it's been a little while actually since I've done a small business like vlog slash what I do. So that's going to be today's video. So before we get into the rest of the video, I would just like to thank today's sponsor, which is Ana Luisa. Ana Luisa crafts high quality gold plated pieces ranging from $39 and they're carbon neutral and sustainable from their packaging to their products. So the current jewelry that I'm wearing is actually from Ana Luisa today. So they kindly let me pick out three pieces from their shop and I just picked out the Rocks small earrings, the Sia gold, which are these really cute like paper clip earrings which I feel very cool wearing it and then also I picked up the Leo regular short which I feel like is just the perfect layering necklace or just like on its own kind of chain thing and I just got it in the 16 inch length yeah they were super gracious in sending me three pieces and they actually came in this really cute packaging it just looks like this the earrings came in one each and then the necklace came in this pouch which has like a divider which I think is really cool for traveling and stuff. I've actually purchased from Anna Luisa a couple times before. I have a few necklaces already. So it's pretty cool that they were sponsoring today's video. So that being said, I definitely recommend checking out Anna Luisa. And if you do end up checking something out, just click the link down in the description below and then also use code ANNATRAN10 for 10% off your order. To get started for the day, I'm just gonna package a couple orders and then ship them off. And then I'm actually gonna go to the fabric store. So I'm gonna go there and just source some fabrics because I'm thinking of doing another style drop um, for the summer. I've already done two. Um, check them out if you haven't. There's the Esme top, which is like a tube top um, corset back style. And then also just a duffel, like a mini duffel bag. I don't know how vloggers do it dude like <laughs> the camera is so heavy but um so i will go to the fabric store and when i come back i'll show you guys um the fabric that i'm planning on getting and or that i got and also the design that i'm planning for this drop it is another top and i'm honestly really excited about this one and it's very much getting inspiration from like reformation and, like mirror palais and stuff so Really excited about this. Also, like, even the shoot itself um, for the promo and the pictures of the finished piece. I'm going to pull some of those inspirations. So I will probably also record a bit of behind the scenes of taking those photos, too. But, yeah, so... So I'll just ask the 
so, okay, so we're gonna just go ahead and go to Lens Mills, and then, yeah, so we're gonna do that. Let's go. So here is a little haul, a little fabric haul. Um, first off, I picked up basically what I think the entire line is going to be um, in the color of, which is just like this really pretty silk charmeuse. Charmeuse? Charmeuse? It's my favorite fabric ever, though. I love this fabric because it's just like satin but it's just like sort of stretchy and it's just a lot better than satin and then um, I've just got like just a test and see it in different colors but I'm also just really excited to try it out is this green color I just really like this green the shade of green so I really just wanted to make um, the top in this as well just to like try it out see how um how it is um so i'm excited to work with this one too and then i just got some like cording to go with it usually i just make the corset loops with the actual fabric but i wanted to try this out this time since they had it there so i got it in white and then the green for um the corset back because of course i've got to include the corset back for this style top too because i just do that with every single top i just love corset backs because it's like an added style element but also it's just like really good in terms of fit because it's super adjustable for yourself too like you know you know maybe one day you're more bloated than another day corset backs are really like lenient in that sense which i really love um and it also looks amazing so yeah i also have lace that i got yesterday um which i'll show you guys after and also just like ribbon and stuff like that so yeah let's start to sew <laughs> So I went ahead and made the top. This is in the green, so it's kind of like a prototype um, top, but this is kind of how it turned out, which honestly, I'm super happy with the way it looks. And then the back is again, like this really nice lace up. And I think that I like that it's sort of a little bit longer as well. Um, I also really like the silhouette. Some modifications that I realized when I kind of was sewing was that the string needs to be quite long and then yeah but overall I'm pretty happy pretty happy with how it looks just like a really simple top but then the back has some pizzazz yeah so this is how the white version looks I guess kind of like prototype one now I'm gonna sew it like the good fabric um, which is just the white and then this is the lace. This is the lace that I picked up. Top, I want to put like some lacing in the center. So, so I'm going to go ahead and sew it in the white and then, yeah. So. So that is all that I have for today's video and my third, I think third or fourth small business sort of vlog thing. And don't forget to check out Anna Lisa and use my code at checkout if you'd like 10% off and um, my Instagram shop or my Depop shop if you'd like to purchase anything from For The Love Anna. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video and if you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and share with family and friends and ciao! <laughs> I got a new haircut I hope that it can